I'm trying to find the me that I like. I seem to have lost control. I'm trying to find the me that I like, but it looks like I misplaced my soul. I'm trying to find what's under my skin that hides from the glass in the mirror. I'm trying to find the me that I like, cause the me that I like isn't here. I remember when I was a young man back home, it was then I was my own best friend. Now it's no fun being here all alone Cause this friendship has come to an end Yes, I'm trying to find the me that I like But it feels like I've drifted away I would pray to the Lord for the me that I like But I find I don't know how to pray Now I don't mean to make you feel sorry for me Cause I know you might feel this way too But if you can't find the you that you like Then I feel so sorry for you Cause I'm trying to find the me that I like but it's hard when you're out on your own well I look to the world for the me that I like but I find that it left me alone that was the song that was taught to me by uh, by the composer uh, Richard Wilson um, many years ago and uh, it sort of spoke to um, many of the journeys that I went through and many of the journeys that all of us go through is we're trying to find out who we are and um, what we're going to become. But it reminded me, the, the reason I came to this song is because a friend of mine taught me a song about butterflies that I'm going to sing for you a little later. And it reminded me about what butterflies are. And this is a butterfly that a friend of mine gave me um, as a... Uh, just as a memento for a long time ago and I always look at it and think at one point this butterfly was a caterpillar and then it became a cocoon and then it became a butterfly and the caterpillars aren't always that pretty and the cocoons are definitely ugly we find them stuck underneath things and hanging from plants but the butterflies are always gorgeous and we have to remember that as we go through life we, we become more and more like the butterflies, that we eventually become that beautiful thing that we like in ourselves. And uh, it, it also reminds me at a time that when we don't get to see so many of our friends, when we feel very alone, um, that how important it is to be together, to have other people tell you um, what it's like to be, um, what it's like to be you, how, uh, how good you are, how great you are. And uh, so it's likewise very important that when you're talking to your friends, realize they're feeling the same way too. And that you need to say to them the good things about them. Not just, uh, we, sometimes we get nasty and we say nasty things to, to our friends. And we shouldn't do that. We should remember to, um, to say good things and help them to hatch into beautiful butterflies. And we know that when we do that, we'll become better and more beautiful as well. So finding the you that you like can be a bit of a chore sometimes. And I love that song because of that. So when it comes to thinking about butterflies, another friend of mine, uh, Cyril, you may have seen him in the church service a couple of weeks ago, he taught me a song about butterflies. And I'm going to sing the butterfly song for you now. So in this song, if, if I were a butterfly, it talks about how we should be thankful for the things that God has given us. Sometimes we wish we were somebody else or we were something different. Remember, that's what that um, trying to find the me that I like. And it's really important that you find the me that you like, the you that you like, because um, 
there is something very special and unique about you. Um, God made you with special gifts and special tools and with a special purpose for life. And it's for up to us to find out what that is. So what this song is about is, is if, if I was something else. Um, in this case, if I were a butterfly. It goes like this. If I were a butterfly, I'd thank you, Lord, for giving me wings. And if I were a robin in a tree, I'd thank you, Lord, that I could sing. And if I were a fish in the sea, I'd wiggle my tail and giggle with glee. And I'd just thank you, Father, for making me me. Cause you gave me a heart, you gave me a smile, you gave me Jesus and you made me a child. And I'd just thank you, Father, for making me me. If I were an elephant, I thank you, Lord, by raising my trunk. And if I were a kangaroo, I'd just hop right up to you. And if I were an octopus, I thank you, Lord, for my good looks. But I thank you, Father, for making me me. Cause you gave me a heart and you gave me a smile. You gave me Jesus and you made me a child. And I just thank you, Father, for making me me. If I were a wiggly worm, I thank you, Lord, that I could squirm. And if I were a crocodile, I thank you, Lord, for my big smile. And if I were a fuzzy wuzzy bear, I thank you, Lord, for my fuzzy wuzzy hair. But I just thank you, Father, for making me me. Cause you gave me your heart, and you gave me your smile. You gave me Jesus, and you made me your child. And I just thank you, Father, for making me me. Sing it with me this time. Cause you gave me your heart, you gave me a smile. You gave me Jesus and you made me your child And I just thank you, Father, for making me me So this week, when you're, if you ever have any of those moments where you're feeling lonely and you're thinking, I wish I was somewhere else or someone else, look around you and think about the things that are really, really good um, about where you are and who you are and try to find the you that you like. Let's bow our heads for a minute and just pray. Dear Lord, help us to find the me that I like, the you that I like, the us that we like, and the place that we are in that we can like it as well. Help us to not be envious of other creatures and other people, and just to like and love ourselves as we should. Amen. We'll see you in a couple of weeks. Bye-bye.